Hello everyone, and welcome back to Johnny Acres. I'm Joe, and we're back playing Farming Sim 19 on the Pacific Northwest, the Pacific Northwest map. There we go. And puppy's out of food again. So I'll give him some food. And there he is. He's not magic dog like on Stone Valley. Okay, we have all the fields done. Yes, we do. And they're all weeded. All we need to do is sell off all these bales. But first, I will grab another contract. Get that going. 24,000 for sewing. It's actually not a bad one, 24,000. Yeah, that there's no others in the 5 digit range. So yeah, we'll grab that one. And we don't have a sewer that big, so we will borrow the items. Okay, I will buy more seed here too. I have a feeling this will take a lot of seed. Why is the maintenance indicator so low? It's like almost at half. In oats, you say. Oats is selected. Oh, there's even a weight here for me. Sure, I'll put the weight on too, I guess. That is a big cedar. I think I have the same one on Stone Valley. I just haven't used it yet. Still debating whether I should sell that one or not. Glad I got three pallets. Oh, I wish you would have taken from the one that was already half used up there. But oh well, I have a feeling we'll be coming back. Yeah, that's going to be this one right here. Unfold this thing. Get a helper seating away. And there he goes. With the Amazon planter. Or cedar, whatever it's called. Is he dragging that weight? He is too. Oh, that's right, because I had the weight selected. Because that was the last thing I put on. Well, hopefully it doesn't impede him too much. Okay, let's sell off the bales. So I've been going through all my DVDs and Blu-rays. I collected a lot of them. Holy. My friend came over to my old house a few years back and actually asked me, do you act, do you know how much money you spent on all these? And it, we did up an estimate and it was in the thousands of dollars. I'm definitely not going to make that money back. But it'd be nice to get rid of them. I've been in a new house for five years. And most of those boxes I haven't even opened. So I definitely don't need them. So def they're going to go up on Kijiji. 
for uh, at least most of them anyway. I find at the time I was buying any title that looked familiar. A lot of them were very stupid and never watched again. And over the years my taste in mu movies have changed. I like a lot more action comedies now, romantic comedies. A lot of the buddy comedies or a lot of the comedies with more adult humor in them. I'm not into those anymore. I find most of the ones I'm selling are those types of movies. I just don't like them anymore. Kind of like the new DLC that's been announced for The Sims. I'm not into Star Wars. I get why they're doing a Star Wars game pack. It's a great marketing strategy. But it's definitely not something I'm going to buy. Another 9,000 plus. I never really did get into Star Wars. That's largely why I don't want to buy it. Never got into sci-fi very much. And I really didn't get into that uh, this whole Star Wars trilogy or series, whatever it's called. And honestly, I haven't bought in the last few packs from The Sims. There's a lot of games now, even like this one, where there's a few things in the pack that are great and that you'll use often. But most of the pack is just more of the same stuff. I think one of the last Sims episodes, I went over just how much less they're putting into each, one, each new world. Yeah, they started out with five. And for a while they started only putting four neighborhoods in each world. And now they only put three. So there's a lot less livable lots in The Sims. And I'm going to be the, make, making some changes to the channel here. I'm not going to be doing Minecraft anymore. And it's not because nobody's watching or I don't want to do it anymore. It's just I've reached the cap of how much my internet provider will uh, let me use. So I can't actually upload as much. And Minecraft is the la least watched series. If I had my choice, I wouldn't do The Sims. But everybody seems to like it. So, SnowRunner will move to Wednesday. I might keep it on Mondays, but I will try the next couple weeks doing it on Wednesday, my Monday's episode on Wednesday instead. Now I could probably see if there is an unlimited data package I can get, but I think you can't get those anymore. You might still be able to, I'm not sure. But if you can, they are crazy expensive. And I don't have the money to do that right now. 
So either way, I got to reduce how much I'm uploading. And this coming week, I will have the two snow runners back, but uh, I will have the, the second snow runner Mondays on Wednesdays instead. And I'm going to see how that works. If that makes my editing schedule work any better with my work schedule. Yeah, if you want to see the schedule change at all, let me know. Let Put a, something in the comments saying if you'd rather see me upload later in the day. Or if you'd rather, or if there's a series you prefer more than the other. Because right now I'm going, I'm going off the amount of views and uh, how long people watch the series, and watch the videos. And the most views seems to be on The Sims and on Johnny Acres here. And second to them are, would probably be Stone Valley. And when I look at my top 10 videos for the past month, there is no Minecraft videos on there. So they're not definitely not getting the views that Farming Sim 19 and SnowRunner and the Sims are getting. Maybe it's the day I'm posting it or the time I'm posting. So that is why I'd like you to put in the comments which one you'd prefer. Because although Stone Valley is a great idea for a series. It may be that people don't want to watch that type of a series, a start from scratch series. Because that is going to be a very tedious and mundane series. Looks like I'm going to have to wash this trailer after. I've still got one at the farm. Can't forget about that one. I might have exactly enough. Oh no, I got a couple more up here. Oh, a few more. Now, we'll have everything done field-wise, so there really won't be anything more to do. I'll check on the animals once I get that last load down here. And uh, I'll also cut some more grass around the pig pen. I didn't need that sign either. 66,000. Still nowhere close to buying a sizable field. But we can always make more silage bales. Which is which I think I'm gonna do next. Because we still got all around that field we just planted in the last episode. I just went to a barbecue this weekend. So a bunch of my classmates. Nice to see a lot of them again, especially the ones on the radio side of the program. I took television, so a lot of them I haven't seen or met up with since uh, we were in the second semester. So it's nice to see what they've been up to.
It sounds like they're having a much better time than some of us trying to get into the journalism industry. A lot of places really have been laying off their unnecessary staff, which include students. Sounds like radio has found a much better way of doing social distancing. I am now at exactly half. Oh, this is my own tractor. I really should repair this too. Once I'm done my selling these off here. Because I will need it repaired because I'm going to use the same tractor for cutting grass. Okay, I'll go grab that bale back at the farm first. Oh, we could also cut this tree down. Maybe I'll do that instead. Finish cutting trees down. Never got back to that. And here it is. That's it. Now this won't bring us three grand. Okay, it is time to give this trailer a wash and repair this tractor. Now we'll move on to something else. Move on to the trees. Finally get rid of those trees. I'll cut the one down in the farm. And then I'll cut maybe two down at the field there. The grass field. Well that was about half an hour. So about half my time. Doing these bales. Yeah, I'm getting a lot more strict with how much time I spend recording. I'm just cutting out way too much and the episodes are getting just too long. I want to keep Farming Sim, uh, both Farming Sim series and SnowRunner to 30 to 33 minutes. And some of them are getting way up there to about 38 minutes. And I like to keep the Sims to about 22 to 24. I also need a stump grinder eventually. All right, let's give this a wash here. Oh yeah, this definitely needs a wash. And since I'm going to get stuff repaired anyway, I might as well take this trailer over too. Hello doggy. Still no name for doggy. Repair that. Now I wonder if it'll pick up the weight. Nope. That's fine. I'll repair the weight when it gets really down there. Where is that? There it is. Yeah, I'll repair that. Good. Yeah, that tree's gonna go. Okay, let's cut this, this guy down right here. First, let's check on that cedar. Oh, you're almost out? Well, before we cut that tree down, we might as well fill you back up. I think what I'm going to do is just put the seed that I have still at the shop in here. So I don't think I need that much. 
because I don't need to do the entire field anyway. So, taking that into account, and how much is already done, I really only need to fill it up halfway, if that. Yeah, so I won't need, I don't need a lot more seed. 84%. Yeah, that should be good. Or that's exactly 50%. Okay, we'll bring this back to the field and then we'll get back to cutting trees down. Doing some logging. I'll make sure I have the right tool selected this time so I'm not lowering the weight. And he's off. Very good. Seed away while we cut trees down. Okay, this one here is next because this gets in the way of any pretty much everything that I do on this grass field, whether it's fertilizing or cutting. Probably should have done it the other way. Oh, it didn't land on the road anyway. Whoa, careful. Don't crush me. Okay, we'll cut this one off. Would have been so much easier to cut it the other way. Now I've got the bush to work deal with. Well, actually, that'll be easy to work around. Let's landscape it. Yeah, here we go. There's a bush right here. There we go. Yeah, that works. Oh, and there's still some here. Right, 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 where? Here. Right around the trailer here. There, that's better. Yeah, there we go. Now I can see better. Beautiful. Uh, I gotta get closer. There. Okay, gotta deal them a little more here. Okay, cut this one off. Wait for the green, there it is. And it's coming towards me. Who's out here honking? Oh, sorry dude. Uh, just cutting down a tree here like you ran into it a little bit. Contract's completed. We're definitely not letting him continue because I don't want him wasting all the seed. We will take this somewhat close to the road, I guess, or back to the store. And we'll unload it. The good thing is, because I'm so far away from the tree now, the guy that's stuck in the tree that will have despawned. What's going on here? Well, you guys just 
hit each other all the time? At least it's not all backing up all the way to the, the end of nowhere, like it did in Stone Valley. Okay, I will maybe unload right here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, collect on the contract and then we'll get on to something else. Collect. This one up here, 5266. And what I'm going to do should I lease a header? The reward would be reduced by 829. Okay, how much is a header? Go to the garage. I have a John Deere uh, T560. T560 is right there. And it looks like I'm looking for the 608C for headers. Leasing cost, oh, 1,900. Yeah, it's gonna be way cheaper just to lease the harvester. Oh, right, uh, right to the north of me here. Okay. I don't need the tractor. Because I'll just use my own tipper. Where's it going anyway? Oh yeah, the flour mill? It's like right next to the field. Yeah, I'll just use my own tipper. This is a good harvester from Massey Ferguson. This is usually my first upgraded. This is usually what I upgrade to when I first upgrade, upgrade a harvester. Oh, sorry. Dinged up the tractor a little bit. The thing I like about this harvester is the corn header folds up. You don't need a header trailer or anything. Well, I'm sure glad I got through the majority of these DVD collection. I'm, I'll be selling at least half of it. Looking through some of the titles, I'm, I wondered why I even bought it. But it was an impulse buy back when going home and watching movies was easier than going out and saying, Hey, my name is Joe. It's just a lot easier to hang out in the basement and watch movies all day. And everybody warned me, you know, why are you buying movies? They're going to be worth nothing when you can just download them off the internet. And now you can do exactly that. You don't even have to buy them. You can stream movies now. Mr. Patient behind me again. Yeah, the guy disappeared from the tree. Well, we don't have any grass yet. We don't have any crop yet yeah, sprouted in this field over here. And this one, coming up on the right, is the one I'm looking for. Corn. Okay, let's go finish delimbing the tree.
Okay, we've got some on the trunk here. Come on, I want this one that's on top. Not the bottom one. There we go. That's what I wanted. This here. Where was that green circle? There, wait, wait, where was it? No, I'll take this one off. There. Okay, there is my green circle. There we go. One last branch. There we go. Entire tree, D limb. So, we are now at time here. In the next episode, I will pick up all these branches, the bigger branches anyway, and put them in the logging trailer here. So, that is it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, Please leave a like and let me know if you want to see something different. I would love to see what you want to see different in these in this series. I'd love to hear what you want to see different. Until then, until the next episode, we will see you next time. Have a great day everyone.